Hello boys and girls, welcome back to another year of PE with Coach W. I hope you guys had a good summer. I know it's tough having to do remote learning, but we're going to try to make this as fun as possible. Um, we're going to try to make it easy today since it's the first week back. And we're going to do some yoga together. It may just be nice, easy stretching and do some yoga. And I'm going to mix in a couple of different stretches with that. All right, so uh, without to anything else, let's... Uh, begin all right so first we'll start with uh, while we're sitting in our crisscross applesauce remember when we always sit like this crisscross applesauce this is what this is called okay back straight okay I'm gonna start left arm out I'm gonna grab behind my elbow pull it across so you should feel the stretch here pull it across and count to 20 go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. Good. Relax. All right. Right arm out behind the elbow. Bring it back. Count to twenty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Good. Now we're going to do the elbow up behind the back, okay? Now when we do this, this is supposed to stretch this muscle, okay? So I grab my elbow right here behind my head and I just pull it over. Count to 20. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. And relax. And then switch arms. Arm up. Grab the elbow, pull it over. Again, you're split, you should feel it all right here when you're pulling. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. Good. All right. And now we're going to start doing some leg uh, stretches, and we're going to get ready to move into the yoga. So first, off our crisscross, we'll get right to our knees. And we'll sit right here, and we're going to stretch our quads out just by sitting right here. All right, we'll sit and just like this, and just rest for a second. And just breathe in through your nose, down, out with your mouth, in with the nose, out with the mouth. Okay, count to ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good. All right. Now we're going to go up, okay, now we're right here to frog squat, okay, I'm going to sit right here in this stretch, all right, count to 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10, stand up slow, very good, okay, arms up in the air, rotate them around, see how my arms are out front, then I push them up and then back and down. These are backwards arm circles, see? I'm up in the front and then I come back and down. Like I'm pushing up, see? I'm pushing up. These are gonna be called big arm circles, full as you can. We're gonna do 10 of these. Okay, here we go. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Very good. Relax your arms, shake it out if you need to. All right. Now we're going to do the forward ones. Now remember, when you do forward, now you're pushing down. Okay, see, I'm pushing down the air. Look at my arms. I'm pushing down and then coming back around. So don't get confused. Watch what I'm doing. Here we go. Ten. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. All right. Now I'm standing here. Feet together. I'm gonna bend down. Touch our toes or as far as you can reach. All right. You're going to slide down, slide down your shins, and you're going to grab 
Don't bend your knees though, okay? So watch what I do. If I can't go all the way to my toes, that's okay. Just try to go as far as you can, all right? And then we're gonna hold it and count to 10. So ready? So I go down and go as far as I can. And I'm holding here and go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, and up slow. All right, we'll take a quick break. Five, four, three, two, one, and we'll do it again, and down. See if you can go a tiny bit farther. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten, and up. Nice and easy. And one more time. Last one, see if you can go a tiny bit farther. Push yourself a little bit more. And down, see if I can get my toes. There they are. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine and ten. Good. I got to my toes. All right. Now we're going to start doing some of the yoga. So from right here, I'm going to do the first one called Downward Facing Dog. So keeping your feet together like you were going to bend down and touch your toes. I'm going to take my hands, walk them out, keep my knees straight. Okay. And then push my head down. Okay. So you're like a triangle. And with this, you're trying to push your heels down. You should feel it in the back of your legs. All right? And we're going to hold it. Count to 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. And let yourself down slowly. And now we can sit in our Indian style. We'll call this Indian style. And we'll rest. 20 seconds. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. All right. The next one is called the low lunge. All right. So first we'll start with the right leg. I'll bring it up. And then I'm going to go forward as far as I can. Or I'm on top of my leg like this. And I'm pushing down. And I'm stretching. And if you look at my back leg right here, see how I'm lifting my knee off the ground? My knee's off the ground and my toes are pointed. Now you count. Count to 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. And slowly work yourself back. Step back to our original Indian position. Now left leg up. Slide forward as far as you can on top. And so if you notice, my heel's off the ground. I'm putting all my weight right here, and I'm going far enough forward. Now I can pick up my knee off the ground there, and I'm squishing it, I'm stretching, and I'm counting to 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and back. Nice and slow. All right. This one right here is called the toes pose, all right? So I'm sitting here, I'm pushing my toes now straight down and my heels are up and I'm sitting here and I'm trying to put pressure on my toes, all right? Don't put too much, but you're stretching your toes out. Now I'll count to 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Good, relax, okay, and we'll just sit normal, stretching the quads out again, count to 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, all right, the next one's called the reclining hand to big toe, watch what I'm going to do, so now you're going to lay flat, flat on the ground, Ugh. And you're going to try to keep this part and your head, and you're going to keep one leg down. So we'll start with the left leg, straight up. Try to bring your toes back as far as you can. And try to reach up and try to grab the toe as far as you can without bending the leg. Count to 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Now down slow, and we'll switch it. Bring this leg up. Now switch, one, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and down slow. Very good. And sit up. Okay. And the next one now is called the reclining pigeon. This one's a fun one, guys. The reclining pigeon. You're going to like this. Okay. It's a little more complicated, so we'll go slow through this. Okay. So you lay down. And we'll start with the right leg first. Okay. Take your right leg. Put your ankle right here behind the knee. Okay. And then I'm going to grab right here on this leg. And I'm going to pull my leg forward and pull my head up. So now I'm stretching the leg and I'm pulling the leg. You should feel it right in here and down in here. All right. So I'm pulling it forward towards me. Count to 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Down. Now we're going to switch. Your legs flat. Okay. Right knee up. Left leg across. Ankle right behind the top of the knee. Reach through. Grab behind your leg like this. And pull it towards you. And count to ten. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. All right. Now, another one, since we have both the legs up, grab your legs, grab your knees, grab your wrists if you can, and squeeze them together and pull them down. Pause it. Okay, so I'm just squeezing my knees and I'm pulling them up and trying to get my head and my knees. I'm going to count to ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, the next one is called the reclining cow face. This one's a little bit tougher. It sounds funny. Reclining cow face, all right? This one's a little bit tougher, so you got to watch real careful. Okay, I'm laying down again. All right, I'm going to bring my legs up. First, I'm going to take my left leg, uh, excuse me, my right leg, and put it over here and I'm going to grab my left ankle here and I'm going to pull it now this way. Now I'm making kind of like a T shape. All right, so I'm pulling. As I'm pulling this leg right here, I feel the muscle pulling here. That's where you feel the stretch. So if you're doing it right, you should feel the stretch. All right, so count to 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Good. Now we're going to switch. All right. Put this one now in front. Grab my right leg and go down across, make a T. I'm pulling my right leg. Count to 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. Very good. All right. Sit up. Uh, what did I do here? All right, we got two more to go. This is called the reclining spine twist, okay? Now this one is very important to do to keep your back nice and healthy, okay? So lie flat, straight. Left knee will go first, okay? And take it, grab it with your opposite hand, so my right hand, and I'm gonna bring it all the way over and twist, but I'm keeping my hand way out here, just like this. Okay, now the key is to try to keep this shoulder on the ground as I pull the knee the opposite way. So now I'm twisting my spine. All right, count to 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Good. Back to ready. Now we'll do it with this leg. Okay, so my right knee, left hand, I grab the knee. I pull it over. I'm keeping this arm and this shoulder on the ground. I pull it over as far as I can. And count to 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. There we go. Uh, and up. And then the last ones that we'll do will be the tree pose. Uh, uh, oh, no, the triangle pose, okay? Okay, this one's a little bit harder. So, widen the feet, 
Now you're gonna do left hand to the right foot, and then as I twist, then I'm gonna lift this arm up, okay? So here we go. So down and up, and I'm gonna try to look up, all right? Count to 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Good, and switch it. Now we'll come to this side, touch it, and look up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. And down. Last one. Now you should be fully stretched and you should be able to touch the ground really good. Ten seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Very good. All right. Come back to our crisscross applesauce position. All right, so that was a short, um, nice, fun beginning yoga workout. We'll do that. You guys try to follow along as best you can. Uh, we'll end it now, and then we'll talk about it during the Zoom meeting.